oneness. That's it, one. It says in Kabbalah, before we're born, we're one soul, and God splits us. And your half a soul, you go off into this world, and your other half, your soulmate, also goes off into this world. And when God splits you, imagine your soul's like a circle, he does not split you like this. He splits you like this, like two pieces of a puzzle that fit together. And that's why opposites attract. Extroverts tend to marry introverts. People who are organized and detailed tend to marry people who are artsy and flowy. People who like the thermostat up, marry people who like the thermostat down. Why? Because you're half a soul and you're yearning for completion. When you find the right person, you're finding the part of you that was always missing. And the same qualities that we're so drawn to in the other person that complete us are the same qualities that later on in marriage make us nuts. Why can't you be more social? Why can't you be more organized? Why can't you be more fill in the blank? Instead of resenting them, embrace them, celebrate them. Those are the qualities that the Almighty sent to you to help you to become a great person.